Today's date, October 31st, 2023, in Asheboro, North Carolina. Uh, where are we staying tonight, Aria? Are you ready? Yeah. Let's go. We just got into the elevator and we are going to the third floor. Yeah. Are you excited? Yeah. So we got the room reserved last night and tonight room is available. So we're in good shape there. And just a reminder, we're in Asheboro, North Carolina. Home of what are we the home of, Aria? North Carolina. North Carolina Zoo. Yeah. So we're going to take a drive down here. Yeah, Aria kind of had a mishap at school and hurt herself again. Here, Aria, why don't you hold the key, sweetie? Okay. Fifth injury. So, we're going to go ahead and drop the address at the very end of the video like we normally do. And then we are going to go ahead and take a look at this room. We're pretty excited. Are you excited, Aria? Yeah. And then tomorrow, what are we doing tomorrow, Aria? Um, so I but guess if it's raining, then we'll go to the Greensboro Museum. Correct, correct. So it was a little cold today, a little bit rainy. So if the weather's good, we'll go to North Carolina Zoo tomorrow. If not, we'll take a drive to Greensboro. Go to the Greensboro Science Center. All right, Aria, here's our room. Wait, is this one? Right there, Aria. I can't, I'm gonna open it up. Okay, I'm gonna open it up. There we go, Aria. You ready to go check it out? Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna get your wheelchair in there, Aria. I can't hold the door up. Hold the door up. Okay. Now, usually in this case, Aria is giving me a tour of the room. But because of Aria's injury, Daddy's gonna go ahead and give the tour. What do you say? Well, Aria is on the bed. How does the bed feel? So I'm gonna give everybody a tour of the room, okay, Ari? Um, it's not like the, it's actually like the, um, I really try to do the world test, but I don't know. I still don't know, I'll think about it. You'll think about doing the world test. Okay, well, while you're doing that, we have a sofa bed over here. And we have a couple lights. We have the air units already on. Followed by the desk area and the lamp. We have a microwave, Aria. And, here's me. and we have a pretty big refrigerator. And we have me. And we have Aria. Aria's yeah. right there. Yeah, me. And look what I found, Aria. What? You know what Daddy loves to look for. Just be what? Yeah, this is a pretty nice little gadget they have here. It's got three regular ports and then two USB ports. So that's pretty, that's pretty nice. And that's on one side of the bed. I'm gonna check the other side of the bed. See if they have any USB ports on the other side of the bed. Mm -hmm. We just got trick or at Crafting Ball. Okay, and then we have a couple more USB ball. ports. And it is Halloween and night. Mm -hmm. We got TV over here, Aria. And we are gonna take a walk over here and check out this closet. And we have an ironing board. And Aria, what do we use that ironing board for? Um, to iron our clothes. To iron our clothes. And sometimes we use it as a laptop desk. And they have the iron over here. And we are going to take a walk into the restroom. Now some happenings, most happenings I should say, have both a shower and a tub. And some of them just have a shower. So this one here is going to have a shower and a tub combination. And it has a handicap railing there, good for Aria, cause she's not really standing very well right now with her, with her knee and everything. We have some towels over here, blow dryer up against the wall, a sink, and a couple rolls of toilet paper down here toward the bottom. So I would say, you know, again, pretty basic room for a Hampton Inn. And Aria, where do they have the TV remote, Aria? 
Now, sometimes, you know, Ari, we go to the rooms and they have a bunch of apps, like the YouTube and everything. And then sometimes they have regular cable. I like YouTube more, but okay. they just have regular cable. Okay, Ari, you want to go ahead and hit that power button for us? Yeah. Now, let's see what kind of TV program they have here for us. And Ari, look at that size of that refrigerator, Aria. That's a pretty big refrigerator, isn't it? It's probably um, just regular channels. Regular channels. Regular channels. Let's so see, it is... Let's see it. Wait, let's watch the news. Come on. Hurry up. Chop, chop, chop. Hurry up. Well, what you're doing now, I'm going to go ahead and take a look at these drawers. Is this going to go or what? Come on. Good. And so they have three drawers. And uh, it looks like, Aria, what kind of Asheville? weather? Asheville is on the way Asheville, to Dollywood. Asheville. Asheville, there you go. 25 degrees. Oh it's going to be a little cold, it's but that's okay. Degrees. Well, that's later at night, Aria. That's going to be that's tomorrow Wednesday. night. Correct, that's going to be tomorrow night. But we packed a lot of good clothes. And where are we going again tomorrow, Aria? I forgot, I forgot. Where are we going? Where are we going tomorrow, Aria? Oh, at, um, North Carolina Zoo, but if it's, um, um, if it's, um, raining, then we're going to the Greensville Science Center. There you go. Excellent. Excellent save there, Aria. So now tomorrow they have free breakfast, and one of the benefits of the Hampton Inns is going to be that you're going to get that free breakfast, whether you have a gold membership or a diamond membership, right, Aria? So if you don't really go to the Hilton properties very much, this is actually a pretty good place to go to because you always get that free breakfast in the morning at a Hampton Inn. If you go to a Hilton Garden Inn, you know, you're going to have to pay for the breakfast or some of the other fancier Hilton brands. Well, Aria, I think it's time to uh, call it a night. What do you say? Okay, on Wednesday, it's 49 degrees. It's going to be 49 degrees tomorrow, Aria. Yeah. So it's going to be a little cold tomorrow, but it's I not going to be raining. Elephant earmuffs. Elephant earmuffs. That's right. See, so to, so uh, what you're going to need to do then is stay tuned to the channel so you can see our video of the North Carolina Zoo. Yeah. All right, Ari. Well, we will catch you in the morning. We're going to go show everybody breakfast, and we're going to do the final review. So you guys stay tuned. Yeah. Next morning and Ari is still asleep and we are going to go check out the breakfast. time daddy went downstairs to have his breakfast and aria there's only one more thing we need to do and what is that aria the final review, the final review. so aria your thoughts oh, well i'll say good you'll say good okay so for this hotel i would say it's just a very basic hampton inn 
I mean, the room's nice. It's nothing flashy or pretty, but it did have those USB ports. So last night I was able to get both of our phones charged, so that was good. It does have the bathtub shower combination. So if you do have little kids and need to use the bath, then you're covered on that end. I would say the best part about this hotel already, you know what it is? What? The location. Yeah, because it's like next to everything there's like everything around here there's like a chick-fil-a and mcdonald's a sheets last night daddy actually went out to sheets for a little bit to get some stuff and there's just a ton of stuff near her so the location is amazing so i would say the best thing about this hotel is really the location because it's a basic camping in you know it's not flashy but you know it had everything we needed and again if you don't do a lot of traveling this would be a good hotel for you because the breakfast is free. You don't have to pay like $15 for breakfast like some of the other uh, Hiltons. And uh, we have a diamond membership, right, Aria? Yes. But everybody gets to eat here for free. All the guests anyways. Even if you don't have anything like that. So, again, like I said, if you don't really do a whole lot of traveling, this would be a good hotel for you. Well, Aria, right, guess what we're going to now, Aria? The next. That's right. It's not raining today. It was yeah, raining yesterday. By the way, yes. I forgot to tell you if I was going to do the road test or not. Um, I'm not going to do the road test. You're not going to do the road test now? Okay. Well, you did the sleep test already. How was the bed? Was the bed good? Yeah. Okay, the bed was good. So the bed passed inspection as well. Okay. Ari approved. And I'll tell you what, that, that uh, refrigerator, Ari, was a pretty big refrigerator. I wish the TV was a little bit bigger. But you know what, though? I think I'd rather have the bigger fridge than the bigger TV. So I guess we'll take it. Was it was like a tiny old slash TV. Yeah. Like, um, like the 80s, like when you were born. Not already. Uh, I was born in the 70s, first time. But yeah, no, it's, it's one of the newer types of TV. It just wasn't that big. Well, Aria, any final words? Yes. Make sure to subscribe, like, and share with your friends, and happy travelers.